Kevin Cassius, Eiffel TV in association with Mecklen's Jim Marbella. We're in Leeds here at the first direct arena. Fighting on the bill tonight, still unbeaten. Stephen Simmons. Tough, Courtney Richards. Yeah, he's a tough boy, awkward. Um, kept on the move and and uh, then they come and do it. I expect him to come and have a fight because I've seen some of his videos on YouTube and he likes to come and have a war, but uh, he done the sensible thing and try to move and stuff. But it's six valuable rounds I've got. Yeah. Um, it's only my 11th fight, uh, still got plenty of time. It's a learner, it's learning. I didn't start doing what I, I, I do best until uh, three, four, five, and six, starting working behind the jab. I was too busy trying to hurt them at the beginning. Uh, try to load up too much and spoil on the work. Mm. You did seem to catch you with some decent shots early on, and then was it hard to get a consistent run of them yeah. shots throughout the fight early on? Uh, I, I suppose so. Um, I, I just, it's hard to get up for six rounds when you've been fighting ten rounds. Yeah. Um, I mean, I've, I've trained hard and six rounds easy there. Uh, but it'll be good to get get some big fights and get, up, get really up for them and uh, show, show what I'm all about. Who do you want to fight? Fight anyone. No, no, but there must be something you... Fight anyone. I don't, I don't want to uh, start shouting at names and disrespecting people, but mm. I will fight anyone. If you put anybody in that thing, I'll fight them. Well, I'm sure you will, but I just thought you might have a plan of a certain route you might want to I'll go, go down. I'll go whatever route that I'm, I'm going to be uh, taking. Uh, be good to get a British and come off. Uh, maybe that can happen next year. Or an intercontinental title or some of that. But um, I just want to be kept busy mainly. It's, it's only my second fight this year. Mm. Um, so Will you fight again this year? I want to fight before I go on my honeymoon. Mm. Um, I want to fight in November. You might have a fight on your honeymoon. <laughs> so I'm, I'm, away on the, <laughs> I'm away on the 30th of November. So I would love to get a fight in November. Um, I've applied for a tournament over in New Zealand called Super 8. It's like prize fight or what Eddie does. Yeah, yeah. But I'd like to see if Eddie could get me on the 22nd in Liverpool. Just keep me busy. Give me another six rounder, an eight rounder. Just, just someone just keep me going. So I, I've got something a big year to look forward to next year. Yeah. Just keep active. Um, it's no good having a fight and then being at the gym for a couple of weeks because you can't get up for it because you've not got a fight. You want you want to be fighting. So I'm going to go back in the gym on. Uh, Monday and start training again because I'm going to look see if I can get this super eight. I've applied for that, so we'll see if I can get that. But I'd rather fight on. You a said the people that done the heavyweight one recently. Yeah, yeah. Last year they done it. Yeah. So interesting. Bit of experience. Decent Just money to win the first prize. Yeah. And gets what? Thirty-five grand or thirty grand or something. Decent though. That's it. I'll have some of that. That's it. That's it. Um, Oval McKenzie holds the the British title with yeah. your weight. That'd be, he's obviously fighting Matty Askin next. Yeah. Um, and that, fi that fight might be off actually. Is it? I think so. I heard something today, quote me exactly on this, but I believe that fight could be off, I'm not sure. Right. Yeah, it'd be a good fight. Um, I can't predict a winner, to be honest, uh, but it'd be good to get that fight. But you just need to see what happens. I'm, I'm ready to fight anybody. Um, and the bigger fights, you'll see a better Stephen Simmons. Yeah, I get a feeling that. I think the, the better the opponent will be, the yeah. winning fighters it will. It's always been the same in amateurs. The better opponent I box, the better the better I fought. The, in a in a tournament, I was I, bought, I drew a Cuban in the first fight. Obviously, everybody oh Cuban, 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 they're going to get beat. I went and gave him it mm. and won it. Oh. So it's the, the bigger fights that you get up for. Uh, but like you said, six uh, valuable rounds in the bank, you can look at that. Yeah, he's, he's a tough he's, he's a tough kid. He, he, sur he survived well, to be fair. Um, and obviously he's got he's got a fight in a couple of weeks, fighting for an international title or something, so all the best to him and I hope he does well and wins it. Uh, he's still young. I think he should be like heavyweight though. I uh, had a chat with him here when he came in and uh, he's saying maybe he should be like this. I think he should. He's quite small. I was, um, carrying a wee bit, so definitely, I think he's only 21. Could do well in the future. Mm, absolutely.
funny, funny fuck, or no, it's actually it's quite. <laughs> I bet. Quite I've, no watched, I've no watched the interview. Yeah, I've watched it. It's quite funny, actually. Yeah, I'll get a wee watch. Good personality. All right, well, listen, uh, Stephen Simmons, thanks for coming to IFL TV. Uh, don't get chat with you before you're on, you're on your honeymoon. Good luck on your honeymoon. Nice, man. Thank you very much, Cook. And uh, we'll speak to you soon. Yep. All right? Cool. Oh, shout out to your mum as well. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much.